anaphylaxis is a severe allergic reaction, and the way to think about it is histamine release involving all of the major organ systems. So skin, you know, people will have hives, swelling, itching, respiratory, wee, shortness of breath, GI, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, cardiac, tachycardia, low blood pressure, and it could be any combination of things that people have when they're having an anaphylactic reaction. The IgE-mediated causes uh, most commonly are medications, particularly antibiotics, and usually that's pretty clear. An antibiotic started usually within the first couple doses, you see this anaphylactic reaction. In adults, the most common foods are peanut, tree nut, fish, and shellfish. And the rule of thumb there is you eat the food and typically within minutes but up to an hour, the symptoms will start and you'll see this anaphylactic reaction. Stinging insects uh, do the, the exact same thing. There's non-IgE-mediated causes of anaphylaxis-like reactions, particularly contrast the people are getting with their radiologic studies, and opiates too can cause Def, not usually full-blown anaphylaxis, but significant hive swelling and possibly GI symptoms. There's physical anaphylaxis syndromes, primarily exercise-induced uh, anaphylaxis. And then there's some people that will, it's idiopathic, they will randomly have these episodes and we're not able to pinpoint it to anything. <clears throat> 